Making this Lego table was heaps of fun. I started by getting myself a table from IKEA. The table I chose is a dining table. It has a beautiful white finish and it comes with all the tools you need to assemble it. I used the box the table came in as my workspace. I'm also using storage boxes from IKEA to store the Lego in. I just have to decide what design I would like. There's lots of different layouts you can go with. You just need to choose what's best for you. Once you've decided on a layout, you can make some templates of your storage boxes. The design of the table I'm using has an indented cross beam under the tabletop. I had to make sure my templates were in far enough. After you've laid your templates out, you can now draw around them ready for cutting. I drilled some pilot holes ready for my jigsaw. So my storage box fits. I just need to cut out a little bit more so it drops into place. I followed the same procedure for the three boxes I'm using. I cut the table legs to a height of 60 centimetres using my drop saw. Now it's time to assemble the table. The table looks just how I hoped it would. I picked up two Lego base plates from Toy World. When positioning your base plate, make sure you see if a piece of Lego will go from one plate to the other. That way the kids can build across the table. Once you've worked out where you want your base plates, it's time to stick them down. Fill it up with Lego and it's ready to go.
I hope you've enjoyed my video. Thanks for watching.